Everybody feeling more like the end of March, beginning of April, and the wind is strong too. We've had gusts between 15 and 35 miles per hour, and with the rain whipping in here, it's just not a pretty afternoon. The rain will continue to fill in too, and have some heavier elements around during the evening commute. So that'll slow you down a bit. Just uh, plan accordingly. It may take you a little longer to get home tonight with a reduced visibility and road spray kicking up a lot of big puddles too. But after midnight, the rain tapers off, and then as we head into tomorrow morning, look at that clearing coming in. The clouds will be on the decrease, and the sun makes a comeback. So, just have to get through today. Temperatures upper 40s, lower 50s. Chilly, raw feel as the rain continues. A lot of us ending up with an additional half an inch to an inch of rain when the day is done. A lot of clouds and patchy fog will linger tonight, upper 40s, but then the clouds part for sun tomorrow. This is going to feel nice, especially after the chill we've been in. Low 70s inland. The wind light, so a sea breeze does kick in, will be in the 60s at the coast. High pressure will build in temporarily, so Thursday looks good too. We'll start with sun. End up with some clouds, and then a coastal low is going to track close enough on Friday to bring us a period of rain and showers on Friday. But the good news is it's progressive, it keeps moving. So even though we deal with some rain to end the week, temperatures that may be a little bit generous too, maybe stuck in the 60s with rain. We actually climb into the 80s this weekend. 80 on Saturday, mid 80s on Sunday, and lower 90s as we head into the start of next week. That's your latest forecast. Have a great day.